Today's applications need to perform optimally on many different devices and screen sizes. To provide the best possible experience, you often want the layout and content to adjust dynamically. Well, iRise provides a unique set of tools that lets you easily build and test responsive prototypes. No coding or complex equations. You just set it and go. You'll have a set of WYSIWYG icons to use for positioning, and you can also size and position elements by percentage. And you can set up breakpoints to alter the layout or to navigate based on browser size. Want a logo to stick 20 pixels from the top right corner? Just set the position and add a 20 pixel margin. Set your floating action button to the right bottom. Want a text widget to dynamically resize? Just set it to size by percentage or set it to stretch. Set widgets like header bars or footers or banners to 100% width or columns to any percent you like. And you can combine these settings with breakpoints, which are custom screen widths that you set. They allow you to show, hide, or format content, or to navigate to another page when the breakpoints you've set are crossed. They're a great way to show custom layouts for different screen sizes. In this example, the middle text column is fluid because I've set it to size by percentage. And the images on the left are being hidden when the browser crosses a specific breakpoint. And I'm also changing the left margin of the text column to go from 350 pixels to 20 pixels. Breakpoints combined with the fluid layout settings in iRise can be a powerful combo. A one-two punch for creating responsive designs. And of course, you still get all the other stuff that makes iRise special. Fast wireframing, easy jumps and fidelity levels, integrated requirements, real-time collaboration, ALM tool integrations, and lots more. So thanks for watching, and take care.